Welcome to Grumpy Old Man Cycling. I'm your host, Chris. Heading off to Denville, Ontario today. I'm gonna take a go down and ride with my friend Keith. We're gonna start off in Denville. We're gonna ride down to Port Maitland, and along the lake down to Selkirk, up through Fisherville, and up through Kuga, back along the north side of the Grand River, and back in Denville. It's a 90 kilometer ride. Uh, winds are not too bad today. I think they're like 17 out of the southwest, so we'll be hitting a headwind most of the way out and then expecting a tailwind on the way back. So our weapons of choice today are Case Black and Blue Cervelo S2 and my grey and white Cervelo S5 and of course Phil the Duck was riding shotgun. Maitland, we were passing by the Dunville Airport. This airport has significant history as it was home to the number no. six service flying training school, which trained fighter pilots during World War II. Training aircraft included DALs, Harvards, and Ansons. If you'd like to know more, I will leave a link below for the number no. six RCAF Museum.
For those who have ever ridden the Dunville Grand Tour, you will probably recognize most of these roads. They are used on many of the available routes to showcase the beautiful sights the area has to offer. If you are not familiar with the Dunville Grand Tour, look for the link below, as it will surely be something you will want to add to your bucket list of rides.
finally made it down into Selkirk. Got a late start, so it's a little later in the day, but that's okay. So, anyways, this is Keith here. He's the uh, one I've been riding with today. Uh, just heading over to Fisherville now, and then we'll be heading into Cuga and then Dunville. As we were riding towards Fisherville, Keith pulled up alongside me and challenged me to a drag race. I accepted his challenge and we started looking for a quiet section of road. Woo, yeah! Keith clearly thought he had won, whereas I was not sure. It was time to review the photo finish. Well, the camera does not lie, so I let him have the victory. Keith was sprinting away, I was thinking about our drag race. Then it came to me. He's had his COVID shot way before me. This means he's had a chance to harness his new superpowers. I mean, he's been glowing green all day long. <laughs> 